Hello everyone and welcome back to Steel Division 2. Today we are doing part 35 of our Let's Play Every Division in the Game in Order. We are, as you can see, at the German. We're doing the first German division. If you're part of the 55 people who saw my Battle of Armia Krajowa, uh, I invite you to watch it back just because I've made a new one. Uh, the previous one, the guy had a desync, and that's why he sucks so bad. Um, I mean, it's the game that bugged. It wasn't his fault. So um, I made a new uh, battle, and you can go look it up. It's a nice one. But if you don't care for the Allies, and you've been through all of this, like one of uh, one dude said to me, and you've been waiting just for the German, well, rejoice, because it is now. It's happening. So... The elite 5th Panzer Division was called in as urgent reinforcement to stem the Red Army's onslaught at the start of the Bagration Offensive. Bringing years of combat experience on the Eastern Front, this battle-hardened division is well equipped with Panthers, including a small number of fearsome Tiger tanks, making it one of the deadliest German formations in the sector. Uh, it is a heavyweight champion with a knockout punch, but terribly short-sighted. So in terms of recon, uh, lots of good options, but not a lot of guards and expensive too. So I'm not sure we're going to take much recon. It depends. Mm, we're not going to take any of these guys. Although playing the German, you kind of need, you kind of need a good recon. So I'm tempted um, to bring some. These, uh... Yeah, let's bring the spot troop if we're going to bring anyone. And we'll bring what this guy may be. Uh, this is a good stealth, medium stealth. I mean, because if you bring a recon with a vehicle, that a vehicle is going to be a recon as well. So sometimes it can be good to bring them. Optics are very high. Yeah, we're going to take the Kubel MG. And that's 8 recon for us. And uh, then maybe we can take some uh, attack recon for A phase. And have 6 of them. Uh, and then now at 3 points it's pretty expensive. Alright, so uh, this is an armored division. So we're going to take the Ersatztruppen for a face and these are going to be our main infantry for that time period for that uh, for a face and then we're going to have a reinforcement of Panzer Grenadier and those with the uh, bazooka and then I guess we would need some CQC ah fuck if the thing is with the Germans you really need some Officers, I think six should be enough. It's too bad if you bring uh, vehicles, they don't get to be officers themselves, like the recon. But uh, yeah, this is pretty useless. I guess we're gonna bring them with a nice Kubo because this is what officers ride into. Um, is there another choice? Six, six, uh huh. Uh, this these guys got smoke, uh, but I prefer mine with bazooka. There you go, Kubo. Okay, so we'll bring this guy, and then we'll definitely need some CQC. And I am going to take uh, twice pioneer just because the stomp pioneer, they're not that great. Um, I p just prefer having pioneers. Press we'll have these guys come with uh, Animags. And so obviously we're gonna be playing this in uh, balance. Uh, and so B, we're gonna be a bit short on men, but then C, it's gonna start to look uh, pretty good. Or should I actually have these guys in C? And I mean in B. Mm, no, 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 no. Because uh, if we play against the Soviet, then, you know, we need something to counter uh, spam, infantry spam that can occur. Alright, let's 
do that. In the A phase, we're going to bring one tiger. In B phase, I guess we could bring a couple panthers. I think this should be good enough. Although we might want some leaders uh, here. I'll take some leaders here and leaders there. And you know what? Uh, yeah, let's just take. Wait a sec. Yeah, I'll just take these guys as leaders like this. <coughs> I don't need much more, I think. I think that's plenty. Uh, troops. We'll definitely take the Flame Warfare because we want to get there early. Should we take these uh, for the Ersatz? What do they come with? Oh yeah, we could take these with that. That's interesting, I find. Uh, it's a nice counter to half tracks. Yeah, okay, I think we're gonna try that. Why not? I usually never do that. I never take Fair Gendarmerie on, uh, but we are relying mainly just on Ersatz on the, in A phase, so we might as well take a couple and have some Anomags with that. Grill are extremely good. We'll take this for sure. Oof. Oh my god, these support weapons are expensive. I just kind of notice. Uh, Fuck that. Fuck that. I'm gonna need some machine guns. And I'm gonna need a leader. This is gonna be fine because we're not gonna use our leader to fight. And I want the leader to be uh, quick as well. So we got a good amount of uh, leadership here. And you, you playing the German, you absolutely will need that. Um, oh, we got lots of Panzer Shreks. That's good. Uh -huh, heat shells, 180 millimeter at 750 range. This is pretty good, uh, but we're starting to be low on count. So um, 41, and we got air, anti-air, and artillery to choose from. Lots of good air options here. Let's take 188. I guess we could do that. These are just gonna complement the 88. But then again, I could take 637 millimeter unvetted or four. Uh, that's that gives me six. And they're 90 points. Yeah, you know what? Let's just take these and have them unvetted. Probably will have a leader close. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I need to vet my anti-aircraft just because they're so good. I think they're going to be fine on their own. Don't 44 points. I'm going to take some mortar. Oh, God. I love these. I'm definitely going to take some of these. Uh, I don't have much ammo for them, ammo trucks, but uh, they should be good. A8s are a must-take. Set with enough so I can take one more plane. Well, I guess they're gonna be uh, fighter bombers. Just two for Kerwoof. Hmm. Do I really need fighter bombers with uh, that amount of arty? I'm thinking, or should I just take more fucker wolf? Yeah, more fucker wolf. Then I got one point for artillery. And that's gonna go for battery Fourer. Let's have them come in half tracks as well. So we got a few half tracks. Uh, we got OK Infantry. Uh, fifth Panzer video. So we're gonna supplement the Ersatz with the SDKZ 259. Uh, 
You know what? Let's have four. Four, five, six. And then these are going to be two star with him. If we do end up picking the commander early, then these can be three star. We will have lots of officers. I think we're going to take these two, uh, one star like this. And C face one star as well. So that's a lot of infantry for C. Not a lot in B though. B is gonna it's gonna be lacking a little bit. Maybe I should get more Panzer fours. Yeah, I think we could go with that. I think this will be better. B, 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 B. I mean, C, C. Okay, guys. This is the deck I'm going to be using. At first, we're going to just be very defensive. We're going to try to take some flies early with the Flyman Werfer. Uh, supplement them with the uh, MG42 for support. With some uh, Panzer Shrek, Pack 40s, and... Yeah, just be very defensive. Phase B, we're going to attack a little bit more. And then phase C, we're kind of going to go all in if we have to. Okay. We'll see. Uh, we'll, I'll see you in the battle. Goodbye.